welcome students uh, hello today we will discuss a chapter from last year in english literature course entitled the war and the bee it is a poem we will discuss this poem today first of all let us read this poem a war met a bee that was just buzzing by and he said my dear girl can you tell me why you are loved so much better by people than i why my back is bright and as yellow as gold and my shape is most elegant to to be bold and nobody likes me for that i am told now come to the description of this chapter and this stanza student here in this so this that the poet wants to describe every day dear is a kind that like creature which is known as was who came up to the bee and express his feelings with the bee that dear bee or dear my dear relative bee you please listen my thought my consideration that i am who look like you are my appearance is same as yours i resemble you but why i am not as much loved and as much appreciated by the peoples as you do and my shape is most elegant to to be worn and for the the was continue that my shape my back one also look like you and it bigger in the yellow yellow appearance over its back one like the b and nobody likes me for that i am poor but what even then i am considered that i am a superficial or insignificant among the people throughout the society now come to the next section standard student first we have to read this one say the b my dear cousin is all very true but in the they would love me no better than you if i were but half as much mischief to do you have a fine shape and a delicate me and they want you got handsome but then here is one thing which they cannot put up with and that is your thing now come to its description of this one here now the bee that flies to the was which have asked some questions some queries with the bee now we say that my dear cousin dear was you are right that you to look like me you have same appearance and you resemble myself the bee but it's all very true that they would not love you the people would not love you because you always now and then try to disturb them try to cause the trouble for the people for the common people and even i if i myself the be could make any disturbance could cause any nuisance to the people they would no doubt even not like me not like the bee itself you have a fine shape you no doubt you the was have a fine shape shape fine appearance a nice look and a delicate way too but and they know you are handsome but even after knowing the fact people know the fact that you are handsome you look beautiful cute but then there is one thing but you have a thing you have a instrument 
or a thing which is related to you, attached to you, which causes them trouble, which causes the infliction and suffering to the common people. And that they cannot put up with. That's why they cannot bear you anymore and cannot mingle you in a affectionate approach. And that's the sting. That's your pregnant, that's your penetrating organ, the sting.
what they are being able to put some low good and handsome looks. Now, so this poem we can conclude that one's behavior and things make oneself loving and appreciable. Your deeds define your personality, your behaviors, your nature will define your personality, not it will solely depend on. Thank you.